What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So today we are going to talk about how Hollywood has changed over the years. Before we begin, if you enjoy these videos, if you like them, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy the content. A brief history in the early 60s and late 60s and early 70s after that, it was the end of the studio era and the start of the director's era with Hollywood back in films like, uh, you know, from Martin Scorsese or Steven Spielberg or George Lucas. Another important change that happened in the late 60s and early 70s is the start of TV and everyone moved on TV. More episodes, more money, more advertisers and as far as the films itself, people used to go for a movie for a certain filmmaker. So if you know, like Steven Spielberg had a movie out, or if Martin Scorsese had a movie out, or Francis Ford Coppola, or whoever had a movie out. A certain filmmaker releasing a film was a huge selling point, a huge marketing point for Hollywood at that time. Fast forward into the last five to ten years, we see the rise of the cinematic universe. Everything has to be connected, everything is connected from TV to movies, and we see the studios having more and more power that with the likes of Marvel and Disney and Warner Brothers and DC uh, or Universal with their monster verse that they try to do and we see that the independent films are slowly dying people are not watching a movie for certain filmmakers anymore you don't hear about certain filmmakers anymore you hear about the studios Marvel has a new film Disney has a new film Universal has a new film uh, franchises connected remakes all of that has to do with how the scenery of Hollywood has changed. And the next super, super important point and why I think Hollywood has changed in the last years is because of the rise of streaming services. There's so many out there. People want content instantly. Uh, studios have to keep making content all the time. And what that means is there is more, which means less quality, because in their mind they have to be relevant, because otherwise they will get forgotten. So, as we said, you have to keep making content, because otherwise people will forget you, and the competition is huge. You have Netflix, you have Amazon Prime, you have Disney Plus, you have um, uh, Apple TV Plus, you have Hulu, you, even YouTube itself are making content. All these companies are in direct competition with each other. So what that means is they have to constantly keep making content, constantly trying to keep you there. And how do you do that is having a lot of content in one platform and trying to keep you there, which means less quality, which means filmmakers don't have a lot of creative freedom. All right, guys, this has been such an interesting video to me and the things that I have noticed and the things I think why Hollywood has changed in the recent years with the rise of streaming service and filmmakers and independent films getting crushed um, all the time and not being able to compete. Uh, this is my opinion, of course, and if you enjoyed this video, please do leave a like, subscribe if you already haven't, and I will see you in the next one.